same name. I knew, right? <laughs> hey, we're here with Bob and Sherry with the Palm Beach Hounds. You guys look so wonderful out there. I can't believe that, you know, there's actually a hunt club in South Florida. But thank you for being here and sponsoring this wonderful event. What do you think? How do you feel about what's going on today? I think it's really terrific. Uh, it gives us an opportunity to show people what we do and how we do it and how beautiful our animals are and how well they behave. And uh, we're just happy to do it. Now, I'm wondering if you're going to be in the steeplechase race next year. <laughs> uh, need a different horse, I think, yeah. but it uh, looks like fun. A few of the kids could still do it. I'm not sure I'm running to jump these jumps yeah. anymore. Well, that's what you do out in the hunt field. You run gallop like crazy and jump jumps. We sure do. It's not a whole lot different than what we do. Yeah, but we, we're, we're dodging trees and jumping yes. fences, so a little bit uh, of a different... You know, we deal with the unknown quite often. So. Much, I think it's much more difficult to yeah, do the hunt. It can be. Yeah. Right? Yeah. But How long has the hunt here been going on, Palm Beach Hounds? Well, it was uh, founded in 1979 by Ken and Earl Adams, mm -hmm. and, uh, and it's been going on since. So. Yeah, yeah. so exciting. Now, you should have been in the hat contest. Well, <laughs> I did last year, and I didn't have a lot of success. So, But one of our girls won the most elegant, so we were rather proud of her, Louise Palmer. Yes. Now, tell me, if somebody wants to come out and do the hunt, is it easily accessible, and do be, can all levels of riders come out and ride? Absolutely. We have um, several different flights. We have people that like to go fast and furious up front and then we always take care of the people when they first come out and kind of show them the ropes and make sure their horses understand the hounds aren't going to hurt them and you know, everybody has a good time. Well, it's interestingly enough that steeplechase actually was originated in Ireland for a cross-country race from steeple to steeple. And so it actually did start kind of like a hunt. Pretty interesting, huh? Very interesting. <laughs> All right. But people have been fox hunting for 700 years in some form or shape or another. So that's amazing. So down here, with it being so warm, how do you with the scent and all that? How does that work? We uh, we go out early, mm -hmm. you know, and usually uh, prime times around seven o'clock in the morning, okay. and uh, come nine nine thirty, it starts getting too warm and. Once in a while we go to 10, 10.30. Yeah. Okay, do you have a website people can go to? We have a, a website, pbhounds.com. pbhounds.com. Uh, we have a photo gallery and, um, and you know, a little history of us and uh, things like that. Great, well thank you so much. We really thank appreciate you. you being a VIP sponsor today and it was wonderful to see those. I have, the, those horses were so beautiful and you all were so turned out and just <laughs> uh, made the day, especially to start that way. Yeah, thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.